In this question, we're given a list of numbers. There's not necessarily anything significant about this list of numbers, nor necessarily anything significant about the fact that they all end in point two. They are also not in order. We can see that. There are a few typical types of questions about lists on the GMAT. We might have to compute an average of the numbers, their mean, or their mode or their median or their standard deviation. It turns out we just want the value of L, which may or may not be the smallest in the list. Given all that, let's move on to the statements separately first. Statement one doesn't give us much information. L could be almost anything. It could be eight, it could be 800. Insufficient. Statement two gives more information since we have a median. If we put the list of the elements of this group in order, we get the following list. The median is 14.7. That means that L has to be right in the middle so that it can be the median itself. Since we have an odd number of elements, including L, the median is simply the middle number. And since that is 14.7 and 14.7 is not otherwise represented, we must have L equals 14.7. Statement two is therefore sufficient. We have the value of L. The correct answer is B.